Whatever it is, I have it. Oh yes. Oh yeah. Okay, so I saw the swirl. I don't know if I have this, ooh, if it bit, or if it's actually something that I snagged. It looks like he's fighting from the mouth. But he's fighting from the mouth, guaranteed. We're gonna see, I saw a big swirl over there. This is a good sized fish and it's staying down. Watch out, don't get, don't get too early with it. Don't get too early with it. Don't get too early with it. All right. Oh yeah. My heart's just pounding. Whoo. Fish Brain Shane is back with you once again. Welcome to the channel. Listen. I'm back at a spot that I've been at a couple times on the channel. There's been a little bit of drama surrounding this spot and uh, the ability to fish right over there. So we're gonna try to fish right over there again tonight because we know from the first video that we have every right to fish there. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try and get some big fish. I don't wanna get the cops called, but if they get called, I'm gonna assert my rights. You ready to join me? Cue up the music, here we go. Let's go fishing, let's go fishing, let's go fishing now. Hey look, I'm going over to where I can fish legally. Fair enough. I do have the net out in case I catch the world's biggest everything all the time. Ooh. Oh, that was pretty. Dude, I just pulled through an area and a bunch of minnows busted. So, yeah, you know what that means. It's time to get tight. It's time to catch one. Come on, you know you want it. It's getting to be that time of year. You gotta get fatted up for the ice. You know you want to catch or get, or, oh, there was a gulper right there. Which way did you go, huh? Holy crap. Oh yeah, dude. Okay, so I'm gonna switch to a gulp uh, four inch minnow emerald shiner, and I'm gonna put it on a drop shot rig. It's becoming one of my, fast becoming one of my favorite rigs. So I've hooked up a, a little bit of a larger minnow, or excuse me, minnow, a little bit of a larger hook, and I put a little bit of a larger um, weight on the bottom of this because we got a little bit of current in here. A little bit of everything, I'm just a little bit, a little bit. So I'm gonna a little bit hook this and a little bit put it in and a little bit get a fish. Ready, join me, here we go. Oh my God. Oh my God. That scared the crap out of me. I mean, right next to shore dude and he missed it. I don't know. I, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know, but I'm gonna go back. Holy shit. Got one, got one. Oh yeah. All right. Whew. I know you wanted it big fella. Cause I saw you take it. Hold on. Let's get you. Oh, yeah. Nice. That's a nice little bass from this creek. Very small creek, um, as you see, but a uh, nice chunky little bass. He's been eating well. We're gonna get him back in there, but what a fun time, man. That's that one I think that blew up on me right there that uh, you saw, I think earlier in the video. I, I'm not sure if I included that footage, but uh, I guess we'll find out, right? So let's get this guy back in there. Go on back. There you go. Got something? Yep. I'll come help. Okay. I'm trying to get me a... Oh, it's a northern. Is it a northern? Yep, it is a northern. I always want to make sure it's not a uh, husky. Musky <laughs> Little snake fish. Little snake guy. Nothing wrong with that. He liked that rattle, I'm guessing. Yeah. He did 
did smack it on the jerk. All right, just remain still here, buddy. I got some forceps over there if you want to get them off. Yeah. That way, a little safer. <laughs> way safer. There we go. All right, show us the snake. Well, <laughs> Hey, snake! Hey, snakey! Very snakey. Don't bite me. He's a snakey friend. He's gonna bite you. He got the he got Don't the poison. He got the poison. <laughs> poison. He got the poison snake. Little guy. Cool yeah. little bumps on his head. Yeah, and he's got the cool colors on him too. Yep. That's Purple a cool fish. Shimmer. Yeah. Uh, 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 uh. uh he is a fighting hard. The way you can tell the difference between a northern and a muskie is by the dots on their lower jaw. Uh, I think muskie or a northern has five on each side. And musky have six and more. Yep, six I was gonna say seven. I usually look for seven. And seven. and coloration is a big key as well, obviously. But if you don't know how to identify them, that's a good way to do it. It's almost silly to me that there's no bass hitting this. Oh, just as I say that. Oh, it's a good one too. <laughs> like right as I say that. Hello, little bassy feller fighting really good come on up here and see us hello feller well i called it ladies and gentlemen you heard it uh no editing required i asked for the bass i get the bass and i've got some forceps over here i'll get that hook out and thank goodness it wasn't in there loose because i like seeing this guy there you go fella Yeah, sharp little mouth on him. Don't know if he's ever been hooked before, but a cool little fish. We're gonna go put him back right where I pulled him out. He jumped for us a couple times, and uh, yeah, on the drop shot, working good. Let's get him back in. See you later, buddy. Let's get another one. Let's get another one. So I'm just basically, I'm doing this technique because I just learned it, just learned the drop shot technique. And as most of you know that I already fished this technique, it can be used for multiple different species. And I've used it a couple times now for panfish with a lot of success. And I figured where better to try it than the small urban creek that I know of that has bass, walleye, northerns all kinds of different species in it so we are here tonight to see what we can get done i might switch to something else but for right now the drop shot is working pretty well got one there we go oh that's a little bit better of fish yeah oh that's a nice bass Woohoo! Oh, he's jumping. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna net him. Don't get off there, feller. We wanna see ya. There we go. Whew, chunky little guy. Chunky little monkey. He'll lag of the stuff too. He'll lag of the stuff. <laughs> hey, chunky little creek bass. You saw it here first. Bass, love. The drop shot it wasn't first but boy did they love to drop shot huh check him out nice fish chunky nice little creek bass i like him i do i like him he's the biggest one so far and he gave me a great fight gave us a few jumps there we're gonna put him back in and uh we're gonna go back after another one what do you think go get another fish i'm so excited this drop shot's working in the creek and i thought it would let's put him back See you later. There's another one. Oh, little guy. <laughs> Boy, he hit it right up by shore. Look at this guy. <laughs> he's a little feller, but he's got a strong will. Uh, yeah. Just the cutest little bass you ever seen. I can see him hit it. He's pretty cute. Uh, that's a cute little guy right there. Boy, if he was about 15 times bigger, he'd be awesome. See you later, big fella. Oh, got 
got one there. That feels like a good fish. That's almost every cast. Now if I can get it up by the wall. This one's staying down a little bit. It hasn't jumped yet. Oh, oh, it broke. That just broke 10 pound braid. That just broke 10 pound braid. Um, I don't know what that was. But ladies and gentlemen, that just broke 10 pound braid. I ain't going out like that. I ain't going out like that. I ain't going out. Guess what? About a week later, I'm going back. I can't, I can't go out like that with a broken line on a huge fish. I'm going after it. Let's do it. Let's go fishing. Got one. Got one. Oh, it's a little northern. No, I'm good. A little bitty northern. I was just saying that you might show up, little fella. Thanks for the little whack on the uh, pole there. Whack a pole. Snakefish. Well, it's a sign of life, right? Sign of life. Let's be sure it's a northern. It definitely is. It's got the spots underneath here like me and Mikey were talking about. Five spots. It's probably, could be the same northern. <laughs> I'm holding him tight so he doesn't freak out. Oh, and do that. Well, I guess see you later. Got one. Yeah. Holy crap. That's a decent fish. Stand down. Oh yeah, that's a decent fish. I snagged a freaking catfish. That's exactly what happened. Yep. Snagged a catfish. Ah, yeah. Well, snagging el catfishio. <laughs> okay. Come here, boy. Sorry to snag you. I know you didn't bite it. Sorry. I was kind of reeling, which was weird, and I was thinking it was weird that it bit. For the way I was reeling. Yeah. So, what a weird scenario that was with this catfish. Yeah, there's a boy right there. See him? Got him. Decent little catfish. I'd prefer not to get spiked if possible, so we'll just let him go. Oh, really? Well, I know, but you breathe water. So, you can't have it, okay? And your back's gonna be fine. It's not even gonna affect the way you swim. All right, we'll go back. <laughs> now Jason's on one here, what do we got? Net time? You might wanna tighten up your drag. Is it a bass? Well, we're gonna see here. All right. He's okay. Let's see what he is. Nice bass. Yeah. Oh yeah, pig. Bring him on over. Oh, yeah. Good one. Very good fish. It's a little football right there. Now the bite bite brigade begins. I could barely say that. It's a nice fish. Nice fish. Yeah, it's a good one. Yeah. That made the day. So far. So far. Hooked him nicely. Look at that. That circle hook worked well. Mm -hmm. Nice fish. That's a nice creek bass right there. Definitely. That's a big, thick one. Look at that one. Wow. <laughs> nice fish. All right, we'll put him back. Second night's going well so far. Let's get back out there. Good job, Jason. Well, that was a good fight, ladies and gentlemen, that you did not see <laughs> on film because this fish bit when I was unprepared, apparently. And uh, I don't know if I'm going to use this footage or not, but um, if nothing else, I just wanted to show them to you. A nice chunker of a fish. Um, 
I'm gonna have to grab my deal, yeah. Got it. Yeah. All right. Nice fish. That one bit good. Jumped a lot of times and you saw none of it and I don't know why. Sorry about that, but we're gonna get the next one on film. Let's put them back. See you later, buddy. Got one. There we go. Come here, big fella. I like how excited you are. <laughs> Thanks for the running. Whew. Right off the wall there, nice little bass. Decent little fish, not bad. We'll go ahead and get him back in. Not too big of a fish, but good and healthy. Very nice, get him back in there. See you later, buddy. Amazing. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> you see that? How about, look at that. What do you think? You like that? Bite it, bite it. Got him? Uh, no, I've got a freaking, I had a crappie, a big crappie. That's literally what I had. That was uh, probably a 10, 11 inch crappie. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> <laughs> that was a pretty good fish. I saw that. Do you see this? Big ass swirl up there. Yeah, I mean, it was big. And I, oh, oh boy, I thought I had it hooked for a second. I was in the middle of casting. And I actually threw right over by it. Oh, it's still there. It's still swirling over there. What the hell is it after? There we go. Got him. Whatever it is, I have it. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Okay. So I saw the swirl. I don't know if I have this. Ooh, if it bit or if it's actually something that I snagged. Well, it looks like he's fighting from the mouth. But he's fighting from the mouth, guaranteed. We're gonna see, I saw a big swirl over there. This is a good sized fish and it's staying down. Watch out, don't get, don't get too early with it. Don't get too early with it. Don't get too early with it. All right. Oh yeah. It's a good sized cat for this creek boy. Look at that one. <laughs> wow. The circle hook did its job on this one. Nice fish. He swiped at it, but it looks like I got him in the side of the face there. So I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to go ahead and get the forceps. That's a nice catfish right there. Fun to fight. Um, I don't know how big it is, but we're going to say it's 15, 30, maybe 60 pounds. Probably 60 pounds right 66. in that area. Somewhere in 66 pounds, yeah. probably in that area. So we're going to put him back. Thanks for the fight, big fella. Nice catfish. Put him back. Go on back, buddy. Well, it's been a great night. Really good night at the creek. And I'm glad I came back for a second attempt to try to get that fish that broke me off. And I'm going to tell you, I don't think that was the fish that broke me off, but I think that's what kind of fish it was. It stayed down, um, kind of fought like that, took a big run. Walleyes can do that, but I think it was a catfish that broke me off. Um, just wanted to let you know, I really appreciate you watching my videos. Make sure you sub if you have not yet. And you know what we say, what a great time. Fish Brain Shane, out.